The following has been made possible with a grant from the Lincoln Financial Foundation. Trach Suction. Review the physician's order. Check the patient's identification band. Ask for their name and birth date. Provide privacy. Explain the procedure. Gather the following equipment. Mask with face shield or goggles. Tracheostomy suctioning kit. Waterproof pad or towel. Wall suction or portable suction. Clean gloves. And manual resuscitation bag. Turn on suction. Open sterile suction package using aseptic technique. Open the wrapper away from you. Set up the work surface and pour saline into container if needed. Remove gloves. Perform hand hygiene. Put on sterile gloves. Review the sterile gloving video if needed. Pick up sterile catheter with dominant hand. Connect the tubing to the suction catheter. Moisten the tip of the catheter into the container's saline. Occlude the Y port or open hole on the suction catheter to check the suction. Use your non-dominant hand to remove oxygen. Attach the AMBU bag to the tracheostomy. Hyperventilate the patient with 100% oxygen by delivering three to six breaths by squeezing the AMBU bag. Remove the AMBU bag from the tracheostomy. Quickly and gently insert the catheter into the trachea with your dominant hand. Advance to the predetermined length. Apply suction by intermittently occluding the Y port or open hole of the suction catheter with the thumb or index finger of the non dominant hand. Gently rotate or withdraw the catheter while suctioning. Do not suction for more than 10 to 15 seconds at a time. Use the non dominant hand to hyperventilate the patient with AMBU bag in the same manner again. Deliver three to six breaths. Attach oxygen. Flush the catheter with saline. Assess the effectiveness of suctioning on the patient. Suction the oral pharynx When suctioning is complete, wrap catheter around dominant hand. Unplug catheter from suction tubing. Remove glove inside out with dominant hand along with coiled catheter. Discard into appropriate receptacle. Turn off suction. Assist patient to a position of comfort. Remove gloves. Put equipment back appropriately. Document in patient's chart. 